Hello, Darth Vigan here, back with another episode of War on the Sea Abdicom Defensive. It is April 13th, and the Truant is south of the Japanese Western Forces. We have spotted a couple of juicy, juicy targets, one being the Congo battleship, and one being the Suikaku carrier. They have spotted us, unfortunately, after we spit our first load of uh, torpedoes out, and uh, so they're going to take some evasive maneuvers. I fired these five torpedoes at the Shokaku, which is actually the Suikaku, Chicago class um, and so it looks like that's probably gonna miss um, I'm a little frustrated because it seems like they detect us no matter what we do uh, I was running without my periscope up even like I might as well raise it up now I guess it doesn't matter but uh, it's, I'm a little frustrated because they spot us so easily and so I don't know I don't know what to do see if these guys collide then maybe we can shoot them while they're stationary I don't know That'd be ideal. Get some nice good hits there. Come on, run into each other. Heck yeah, that would be awesome. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. T-bone. T-bone. And... Fire. Come on, come on, come on, build up the solution again. Oh, those might hit anyway. Build up that solution, build up that solution. Come on, 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 We'll watch the Shokaku and see where she goes. I'm going to go ahead and turn to the hard right and see if we can make a shot if she runs here. So we got the Zuiho might take some of these in the chin here. Which is not my ideal target, but I'm not going to throw it away. It would still be an excellent sink to sink this escort carrier. Really wanted to sink the fleet carrier or the battleship. One of the two, but I'll take what I can get, I guess. Nice. Oh, she's doomed. She's doomed. She won't survive that three hits. She's at critical, critical. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We're going to retarget the Shokaku here. Let's watch her heading and see if she stays on one true heading. If she does, we might be able to get a hit on her which would be ideal. Uh, she's still turning, still turning. I might take a running shot at her, even if she does uh, turn, because we're still pretty close at the moment. Still pretty close. I could turn a little to my left to follow her path here. Yep. Come on, baby. She's still turning, still turning, still turning. zero degrees angle off the bow she's still turning so oh hi could do a three degree spread fire all five just see what I get straight ahead let's do it fire there we go well, we're gonna take a chance we still have three torpedoes in the front this guy's gonna sink for sure so not a total loss Truant will have to go back and get rearmed uh, for some more torpedoes, but we still have the trusty up here as well. So now these are going to be a miss unless they uh, spread enough to get a hit, which I don't think they will. So I'm going to go ahead and speed up time here and see what happens with these torpedoes. Nothing looks like. All right, so he's running straight now. Probably should have waited. I knew I should have actually, but. I'm impatient. I'm impatient. Patience is key when you're a submarine captain. That's why I can never be a submarine captain, I guess. Okay. Let's see if we can get this guy at least. He's running really slow. Is he turning still? He's still turning. Okay. Let's wait for him to finish turning. 
and then we'll fire at him. Oh yeah. So we host some. Fantastic. Okay, he's running, he's coming into us. Okay. Cool. Yeah, he's coming to the rescue of those guys, apparently. Well, aren't you a hero? Whoops. So sorry. Okay. Let's see what this guy does. Let's just watch him for a second. Let's be, let's be, uh, patient for once. Uh-oh. Explosions underwater. Got these torpedoes in the front. Two are loaded. Okay. Well, it's not my ideal situation. Not the ideal outcome, but it's not not a bad outcome. Okay. What are you doing? Are you still are you circling? I mean that's great if you are because I can get even closer. What are you doing? Picking up survivors. You know, that's normally the warship's jobs. <laughs> oh my gosh. Love it. Okay, well Mr. Shikaku in the Congo, unfortunately, but Nothing can be done about that. Oh, we got all three loaded? Yes, we do. All right. I'm going to slow down. I'll let him pass right in front of me, and I'm going to fire. Okay. Hopefully... If I get him while he's turning up to the north, I think we should be all right. Then we're more likely to get hit because he's in that general direction. Uh, this is going to try to fire it this way, see, to lead the target. So if I wait till he's pointing north, I don't know. I could do a manual, I guess. I fired this guy right here. He's gonna go fire right, right there. All right. Let's see what happens. See how good my my eyeballing was. That was like what you call an eyeball. Eyeball targeting. Looks like it might not work. It might. It might work. It might work. Ah, uh, I think he's going to skim right past him. Uh, uh, maybe. Okay. I eyeballed it. Got one out of three. I guess that's not bad. Alright. Well. I might as well fire this torpedo as well. Once I get into a, a little better of a arc of fire here. I gotta remember with the truant, um, you can't look behind him with the periscope. So once I get to a certain gimbal here, yeah, yeah the angle of fire won't, won't work. <laughs> they won't be able to see him. And I'll lose the solution. Okay. Let's see if he continues to turn. He's running slow. Okay. Could just fire this direction. He's running 351. Okay. So I'll just fire. He's not turning. Fire! Let's see if this will go to 351. That's still pretty high angle. 83 degrees. Will it make it? Let's go ahead and 
re reassess here. I mean, I'm not going to say no to sinking the cargo ship. Ah, uh, right past him. Darn you. Darn you all the heck. Okay. He is blown up, though, so that's good. How far away is these guys? 20,000? 18,000? You know, if um, they were a little further away, I'd surface, because this guy doesn't have guns. But one shot from any of them really would kill me. But I don't know what the Congo's range is. Uh, 38,000. <laughs> Even her secondary guns are 16,000 yards. So. Alright. Well, we'll go ahead and fire our last torpedo torpedo because we're going for a uh, rearmament, rearmament anyway. So. We'll go ahead and fire that. See if we can get a hit. Nah. That's a bust. That was a bust. Okay. We'll sit and watch and see if she gets any additional damage from her fires, and then we'll uh, make a decision then. All right, she's got her fires out, so she's not going to get any additional damage. I, I'm considering surfacing and uh, taking a few shots, but I'm afraid Congo will blast me with her big guns here. So we'll just go ahead and retreat. And uh, Truant did a good job sinking the... the escort carrier but Mr. Primary Targets unfortunately actually you know what Congo is at 28,000 range what did I say her range for her guns was 38,000 oh, yeah, yeah. should I risk it should I risk my biscuit pop up take a few shots might just pop up right quick take a couple shots alright let's do it we're gonna take a risk we're going to take a risk. We are going to manually fire. Actually, I don't need to manually, just fire. Okay, ready? We're going to surface. And we're going to shoot at that bad boy, see if we can sink him and not get sunk ourselves. First shots we see fired, we're, we're out of here. We can leave immediately, so. Oh, yeah. Fire already, buddy. Nice. Get wrecked. Nice. Oh, yeah. Boom. Magazine explosion. He's down to seven knots. But we should be able to catch him easily. So far, no shots fired from Congo. One lucky hit, we're done for, obviously. What we got here? Critical, critical. All right, stop. Go and dive. Hold your fire, boys. Get underwater. He's gonna go down. All right, that wasn't too risky. Considering how far away they are. Even if they fire it, it's going to take forever for the shots to get here. <laughs> Got him. Nice. Nice. Okay. Fantastic. Let's retreat. Are you still above water, my friend? Oh, yeah, look, there's the shots. <laughs> That's where they were shooting at me. Okay. Holy smokes! That was close. Holy smokes. Any damage from that? No. Dive! For God's sake. There you go. He was taking his sweet time with that normal dive, wasn't he? Get underwater. Jeez. That was close. Can you believe how close I got in that first shot? That was amazing. 
That was amazing. All right. Well, that's okay. We got it. We got a kill. Got two kills. And now it's time to uh, ski daddle. It's like the Zwiho and the uh, Aratma Maru. With that perspective, it looks like the submarine's a teeny, little teeny tiny thing. <laughs> Alright, we got six points for that, so that's good. Fantastic, no damage to the truant. She's going to come on back down to Sorabaya to get rearmed. The trustee will come over and take her spot as well. And we'll see, well, actually, you know what, let's try to intercept that battleship and carrier group as they head back up because they're going to be heading back up and maybe by the time we get up there they uh, their timer will be reset and we can engage the war spots coming down to Sorabaya as well to get uh, rearmed also and then I guess I'll head up to Banjamasin and um, blow it up it's got a level 3 airfield I'd like to knock it down and then we're going to go start our invasion of Singapore Start our invasion of Singapore. Oh, looky here. Looky here. Lucky. Lucky, lucky me. Let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got here. Let's see if we can get engaged. And bingo. Trusty. My boy. Let's slow down to nothing. And go down to about 60 meters. 50% visibility. Alright, it's evening time. Let's see what Trusty can see here. They're behind me, so Trusty's not in the best position. Trusty can't see behind him. Trusty can't see behind him. Do they see me already? I can't target them yet. There's the Zuiho, and there's the Zuikaku, Congo. Okay. I guess let's come up to uh, Periscope Depth. There they are. Alright. Keep turning, keep turning. Who's number one, Zuiho? Okay. I don't care about him. I don't have my scope up yet, because I don't want to be noticed. Ah, they see me, don't they? Dang it. Do they? What's happening? Alright. Let's target him. Suikaku. Let's target him. Congo. What? Are you drunk? Congo. And this is... Shokaku. Yep. Okay. Trusty turning. Should I shoot at the Congo first? Or go straight for... Oh, he's only got six torpedoes left. I'm going to go straight for Shokaku. Screw the Congo. Scope up. Let's get our solution up to as high as possible. 2,500 yards. Okay. I would love to be able to take this shot. If I can get into a position... Come on, baby. I can just get perpendicular with him. I'll take my shot. Should I shoot all six? I think I will. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Keep turning. Keep turning. Keep turning. Two knots is not very fast. But it'll keep him from seeing me and running. Hopefully. Stupid airplanes. Oh, they saw me. Dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Yep, they're turning. Dang. Stupid, stupid airplanes. Oh, they're coming down to shoot me as well. Alright. Let's go down about 70, 70 depth. 
they see me, so go fast. Okay. Dang. The plane's left. Alright, definitely gonna shoot all of my torpedoes at Chicago. 006, 005, 3, 2, periscope depth, please. Let's just watch Shokaku here. If we can get some shots off, that would be fantastic. What's Congo doing? He's running 25 knots, okay. Okay, here we go. 33, 33 feet, that's it. Let's wait for Shokaku to finish turning. Oh man, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. Keep turning, keep turning, keep turning. Gonna turn, turn, and then I'm gonna shoot. And that'd be nice if they crashed into one another. The Shikaku captain is not very good at navigating, so. Or maybe it was the Suiho captain that wasn't very good, I don't know, but like, he cl he collided last uh, engagement as well. He's got minor damage from it. Okay. Let's turn ourselves. I might fire my aft torpedoes at this guy. All right, let's see what he's doing. He's turning again, okay. Turning back. He's turning back. Let's, let's keep turning. Let's keep turning with him. Okay. I think I will get ready to fire aft torpedoes at this guy who is the Zuiho. That. There we goes. Okay. Okay, fired him. Thirty percent. Very nine. Alright. I'm gonna turn. Fire this guy. <laughs> He's right off our bow. <laughs> oh, I love it. 74, 73, fire. Okay. Switch back over here. Shikaku. Build our solution back up. That's probably gonna miss, but that's okay. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and get our solution back up to Zuikaku. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Beautiful. 80%. That's good enough. Fire. And we're at uh, close enough range. I don't think he'll be able to do just a heck of a lot of evasive maneuvers. At least that's what I'm hoping. That's what I'm hoping. Oh, man. Oh, man. Are they going to gimbal and, and mess it up? Oh my gosh, is he gonna turn and miss him? Oh, I think he is. I think he's gonna miss him. Oh, no, they got him! They got him! One hit, one dud. The other one's missed. Okay. Alright, well, you know. Could have been worse. Could have been all misses. Two actually hit him. All right, do I have any other torpedoes left? I got one back here in the aft. So I trust he's going to have to go back home as well. <laughs> Everybody's going home. Actually, turn to the left, trust him. We'll see if we can pop Shokaku with one more torpedo from that from the rear here. Hongo might get hit by this guy. What's he doing? That would be interesting, wouldn't it? Oh my god, he is. He is going to get hit. Oh, did he dodge it? No, not yet. Come on, baby. He's pretty agile for a big ship. Yeah. He made it. Slipped past him. He greyhounded that, that bad boy. 
<laughs> oh man, they crapped their pants up. All right, so Shokaku, get ready and is he still turning? Yeah. Let's see if I can just fire up this way. Fire. Did I fire? Oh, he's not reloaded yet. <laughs> Darn. Okay. All right. Well, that's interesting. Shikaku is burning. I'm going to go ahead and turn around and see if I can follow Shikaku a little bit. She's still running way faster than I can run. So that's unfortunate. Trusty is out of torpedoes now. She's almost got her fires out. 20 seconds to have our last torpedo loaded. Alright. Is she running straight? No, she's still turning. Alright. Let's see if I can turn with her. Run up alongside her. Okay. Are you going to stay straight? 315? Yep. Okay. He's decided 315 is his bearing. Let's do it. Or his heading, rather. Fire. Probably not going to be a hit, but you never know. Nope. Miss. Okay. Well, that's too bad. That's too bad. What's our damage look like? Moderate, minor. No, not too bad. Too bad. She, she'll probably go, but end up going back to... Uh, docks though all right she's got her fires up moderate minor damage so she might not go back home in which case uh, we will send Trusty back to Sorabaya. So we've expended the torpedoes of both of those <laughs> subs. So I'm going to bring uh, Snapper up here. She's got all her torpedoes, all, though they are the American torpedoes, so they're really crappy. Uh, we got 32 points. I don't know if there's anything I necessarily want to do with them. I might bring up another oiler right at the moment because we got the Raunchy and Rampure bringing cargo and uh, engineering up and troops. So I could uh, go ahead and do one more a uh, group of I could bring in this another Cimarron uh, along with a C3 how fast is a C3 18 knots okay it's 27 points and if I got a little DD with them or a DE maybe for submarine protection. Yeah, it's a torpedo boat here. I got a couple of these. What's the DDs look like? What's the lowest point DD I can get? A five for a Clemson. Clemson's not a bad little ship for protection. It's like maybe Clemson's the only choice. Yeah. Oh, here's an admiral. Admirally. Admiralty class. Let's take a look at their weapons. The difference between the submarine and the. He's just got more. Got one fewer gun. More depth charges. Hmm. We're more likely to get attacked by a submarine. So. I'm thinking the submarine. There we go. Let's do that. Let's get these guys going. And we're going to go ahead and manage their cargo. We will get the Tinnados, some troops, some supplies for her, and fuel for her. And they are going to come on up to Denpasar as the intermediate point. All right. There we 
we go. And Sandstar is coming down to retake Dempazar. <laughs> uh, we're going to get War Spot in here, and she's going to use up a lot of supply because there's certain, lots of ships in here. It's like 50 supplies per ship or something. So it's going to be like 500. Is it? What is it? What's the rule here? Yeah, 50 supplies per ship that expended ammo. So maybe I need to break off some of these guys into a different task force and uh, rearm them that way. Some of them don't really need to rearm, so let's take a look. Isaac's still got lots of 4-inch shells, so does Barker. He has two. Parrot's a little low in HE shells, but that's okay. So I think maybe just Exeter, Hobart, just the big boys I think need to rearm. Uh -huh. I really hate to rearm more than I need to. So let's just do the big boys. So let's uh, split them off. Rearm these guys. There we go. That was still quite a bit of... That's still 200 supplies. But, you know, gotta do what you gotta do. Let's merge these guys up. Back up. Yep. So let's switch these guys. Extra can stay the same. Alright, you are War Spot, Bink. You are Perth, Bink. There we go. Fantastic. And we'll do. Uh, do a nice circular formation. Because we're going to head up to Borneo and devastate this airfield here. So. Let's uh, head on up. It is night time. It'll take us 11 hours. So by the time we get up there, it'll be 9 in the morning. So maybe I should time this a little differently. And just let these guys sit here for a few minutes. And uh, until it's time to, to make that journey. So that whenever I get there, it's night time. War Spot's got an engagement. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Well, I don't want to do a circular if it's going to be a submarine attack, so. I'll do a line ahead. Didn't expect that. Okay. Come on, guys. Oh, boy. Okay, well, whatever. Whatever. Let's throw on your radar, even though it's probably submarine. Yep, torpedoes in the water. Oh, yeah? Okay. It's a normal submarine, normal class, not the little mini subs. The parrot going over there. Okay, Barker. Turn left as well. Electra turn left as well. Oh, I see. Okay, cool. I guess as long as these guys are just going straight, just run as fast as you can. Who is it going for? It's gimbling the go at who Exeter. All right, turn. Exeter is actually it's going after maybe Perth or War Spot. Let's go ahead and turn. Okay. Go that way. Parrot, run quick, please. Four spots running, Perth, go ahead and run. Isaac Swears, go ahead and run. Yeah. Hobart's safe, I think. Four spots turning, 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 turning. Perth, I thought I told him to turn as well, but maybe not. He's too worried about hitting War Spot. Okay. I mean that's admirable. Admirable. If I wasn't telling him to do it anyway. I just want you to, to not get hit by torpedoes, my friend. I care about you. I care about you, buddy. Hobart and all them are all safe, I think. Okay, Perth, you should be safe if you run straight. Parrot, let's go ahead and slow down. 12 knots. We're going to intercept this guy. And we are going to smash 
him to bits. Okay. Clemson, don't you tip over and die. Whoa, they're firing? Yeah, he's still on the surface. Interesting. <laughs> what, what are you, what are you doing? Okay. Everybody hold your fire, hold your fire, hold your fire. Hold your fire, hold your fire, hold your fire. You throw out pings, you throw out pings. Oh, there's like nowhere to hide down here, so. Yep. Okay. Here he is. We'll run up on him. Barker, why don't you slow down? Here. Get on him. Okay. I hate that we lost a few shots from uh, all of our big boys over there, but that's okay. Wasn't too many. Want to save those shots for the short bombardment. This was, this was just a happy surprise. Alright, here she is. She's right on the bottom. We'll run over, drop. This is the least ideal way to drop on a sub, but that's okay. All right, fire. That ought to be a hit. Oh, I meant to stop that. Cease fire. Cease your fire. Okay, we can come back around. What's your damage look like, buddy? Critical heavy? Yeah. All right, Parrot, actually, you just run straight. Barker, turn to the right. We're gonna go in, make a run. He still sees him down there. Searching, searching, searching. Okay. This he's probably gonna be uh, he's probably not gonna survive, but we'll we'll drop on him just in case. I would think a critical heavy would be enough to sink us up, but you never know with this game. I am taking chances. Till we see the wool slit come up. We're not gonna trust it. Still one down though. Keep turning, keep turning, keep turning. He drops them straight down, so. Right, fire. And that'll do it. Nice. Slow down. Come to a stop. How in the world is he still alive? Two practically direct hits from a depth charge. Ridiculous. Okay, it's fine. Let's see if we can get another hit. Really? That didn't finish him off? Let's try again. Try again, I guess. Keep dropping a single. Until we can finish him. <laughs> there he goes. Alright. We're good. Very good, very good, very good. Okay. War spot is... How many subs do they have left? that class whoops 
How many subs do they have left? Of that class. One left, okay. One left of that one. They, oh man, they got a lot of they got a lot of subs. Two left in that class. One left in that class. Two. Yeah, they still got quite a few subs. Still got quite a few. All right. Well, we won't be uh, using those anytime soon. All right, so we're gonna wait till about 9 a.m. Then we're gonna start heading up. Actually, let's let's wait till about noon, and then we'll head up. All right, it is noon. It's time for War Spot, War Spot to start heading up. We do have escort from Sorabaya. I might as well go ahead and throw up another escort as well. I'll throw everything I've got with the War Spot to try to protect her. And uh, keep her safe from airstrikes from Van Jamasen. War Spot again. Wow. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Another submarine, perhaps? Yep, another submarine. Okay. Pillsbury Doughboy. Head on up that way. Full blast. Is this one of those little midget subs? No, it's a it's multiple torpedoes, okay. Hobart, you're next. Go ahead and start turning left. Going up there. Hobart's, Hobart's got lead. Does he? now but I, I want to break with him because I feel like I've got something bad going on here <laughs> I'll make sure they turn hard enough feels very I think you need to turn also let's go ahead and turn to the right see if we can dodge those guys Run straight. Or spot. Straight. What are you doing? Oh my gosh. We're gonna have to turn now. Turn to the left, turn to the left. Are you gonna eat one? Do you see a sub? Is that him? Turn, 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 Pillsbury Doe boy. What are you doing? What are you? You're going to eat one. You're going to eat one. Oh, no. Straight, 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 straight. Turn left. Yeah, Pillsbury might eat one here. Eek. Eek. Oh my god, that was close. Oh my lord almighty. That was rough. That was rough. Alright, Pillsbury. Still searching. Hoping. And wishing. And dreaming. And searching. Where's my airplanes at? Turn off active, go down to passive. Let's see if we can find this bad boy here. Make sure everybody here is running straight. They are. Turn off of eight hazards. Run straight. There we go. Okay. Exeter and gang are all running good. Okay.
Let's see if we can find this guy. Throw out some pings. Got him. Okay. All right. Here we got here. Okay. Well, you're gonna be dead. We'll do a full spread. Airplanes, circle, please. All right. And fire. Start dropping. Start dropping. Oh yeah. Did I get any damage? Moderate. Fantastic. Alright, Pillsbury, just come back around. You can, you can stop now. <laughs> Last one's wasted. All right, so he's uh, oh, is he coming up? What's he doing? Now he's just sitting. He's just sitting pretty, heavy, heavy. All right, here we come on another pass at the old submarine. We'll just drop one. I'll drop one on him. See what happens. And then I'll uh, back up, drop another one on him <laughs> if I have to. Okay, are we ready? Here we go. Oh, he's, is he going down? What's he doing? Heavy, heavy. Okay, stop. Uh oh, is he blowing tanks? He is blowing tanks, okay. Let's go and drop one. Just in case. He didn't have enough air tank to surface. Stop. What you doing, bro? You gonna die or what's the deal? Pretty cool critical. That got him. All right. That got him. Fantastic. Oh, we got a command point for it. Nice. Okay. And freaking tastic. All right. Come on up. Let's see what we got. Ooh, got some airplanes coming up. Trying to engage us, maybe? No, nope, they gave up. Okay. I'm fine with that. <laughs> I'm fine with that. Where was he going? Uh oh, bombers. They're looking for us. Seagull got an engagement. Oh boy. Seagull got an engagement. No ships. Good. Let's see if we can get out of here. Yep. We okay. can. Good. Alright. It's time for the bombers to go home. Okay. Fighters are going home. And... We're going to come up here. Oh, look. Dempasar is ready to be captured. Yay. Nice. Okay. All right. Dempasar doesn't have anything else except for troops to carry. So we'll just leave Sandstar here for the moment. Uh, they're going to need more fuel and supplies and whatnot at Sorbalia. Getting a little low in fuel there. Palombong's fine. And we'll need to start moving all of our supplies up to Palombong, though, to stage our Singapore invasion. But that will be for next time. We are going to bombard here with... Not quite yet. Not quite yet. There we go. Down to a two. Okay. Down to a one. Okay. I think we got one more. Zero, baby. Zero. All right. War spots got no ammo left. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and head on back down again. Exeter has also got no no ammo left. Okay. We'll head on back down. And uh, we're done with that. I hope you have enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure and hit that like button. And I'll see you guys next time.
Bye.